So this week's video will be a update video. It will be uh, some thoughts on a class with a world-class uh, athlete coach today. And uh, yeah, as far as the transformation challenge, I'm gonna talk about my weight loss and, and really what's going on. I hope you stick through to the end. And uh, yeah, we'll definitely talk about my weight loss and how things are going, how macros are going. But first I wanna get into uh, Coach Jordan Gray. My first time with her as a coach today. And that was kind of epic. Uh, maybe you don't know who Jordan Gray is, maybe you do, but I'll, I'll tell you about it. Now, Jordan Gray is a world-class female athlete in the decathlon, and uh, I was not, uh, I couldn't decide today. I, like, I wanted to ask for a selfie. <laughs> Only because, well, because of this video. Actually, I thought about the video afterwards. But anyways, I didn't want to be cheesy. I didn't want to be, it's the first time I've met this person. Uh, first time I've had her as a coach. If I'm going to a studio, you know, cross country, I'll do a, a selfie, things like that. But I didn't want to be like, hey, can I get a selfie with you? I don't, I don't know why, but eh, I chose not to. So the decathlon is an event that is held at the Olympics if you're a male. A decathlon is 10 events uh, in track and field. And uh, Jordan Gray holds the, the current record, uh, probably the best, I, I think, since 2005, at least from my quick research, of course, uh, is the third, uh, holds the third best uh, score for the decathlon ever. And uh, the last one was, uh, I think, 2005. So today she is the best female decathlete uh, in the world. The, the score that she holds is 7,921. And uh, very cool. I, I've seen online that she started a petition to try to get the decathlon into the Olympics for women. She definitely wants to help other women. And uh, maybe if I get real lucky at some point, I can interview her for this channel. That, that would be cool. I, I would like to do something like that. Uh, I like talking, but I like talking to other people more. If you guys ever think of anybody you'd like me to interview, uh, you'd like to talk about Orange Syria or Fitness, love to have you on. As much as I like to talk, and, and I do like to talk, I would rather you know hear more about other people. So as far as this class today at Orange Street Fitness, fantastic class. Uh, again, like I said, my first with Jordan. I think she was here maybe in December when I wasn't taking classes, taking a break. And uh, fun to have a new coach, very, you know, chill, low key, uh, you know, energetic, really great explanations of, of everything on the floor. Uh, 45 minute classes are always a little interesting. And uh, yeah, I got a really good uh, good workout on the tread. Had a hell of a workout there. Got my, you know, 12, 13 splat points, something like that. Uh, moved to the rowers and long rows. Uh, I want to say I got in the, what was it, a 30 second row. I got like 217, 230, something like that. Felt good. A lot of jumping back and forth on the floor there in front of the rower and uh, really exhausted today. I haven't started on the tread in so long and it was nice to get back to that. Uh, and then transition over to the floor, a uh, little bit of heavy weights, probably could have gone heavier on the uh, on these that I'm gonna show right here. Uh, I never know the names of all these exercises. I probably should, uh, probably should learn that one day. But anyways, a uh, hell, hell of a workout and just proud of the work that I put in. Uh, you know, I'm on 700 and like, I don't know, 15 or something like that workout so far at Orange Siri. And, and still feeling good, still feeling motivated, actually feeling kind of reinvigorated lately. And uh, yeah, I'd love to hear your comments. How's your fitness journey going? How's your Orange Siri journey going? Whatever you do, like I say, whatever works for you is what you should be doing. So love it if you leave a comment below. Tell me how that's going. Oh yeah, last but not least, I think Jordan is a, I want to say a Georgia native. She must have obviously coached Orange Sherry down there. Uh, if you've ever had her for a coach, love to hear your thoughts as well in the comments. Uh, so far, I'm impressed and uh, looking forward to the next one. Now on to the transformation challenge. Super exciting. Uh, I want to say this is the start of week two. I weighed in uh, yesterday. At some point, I'll probably share my weight if I haven't already. I'm feeling good. I'm counting my macros now. I started officially on Saturday. And other than one snafu where I was also, it was counteracting everything I did as far as uh, calories burned, then it was adding macros, and, and that's unfortunate in some ways. Uh, so I was actually eating way too much protein, especially yesterday, I went uh, a little crazy. Uh, but yeah, as of yesterday, I was down nine pounds so far in the transformation challenge. Obviously some water weight in the beginning, but I'm, I'm stoked uh, about the, uh, the eight weeks ahead and very, very much, I'm gonna take it well beyond that. Uh, I've got some goals. Again, they're not numbers on a scale. They're fitting into clothes, how I feel when I ski, when I run, 
Uh, when I do stuff with my kids, it's not about the number on the scale for me, uh, but it is, yeah, feeling better about myself and my body. And yeah, that's shedding some weight, shedding some body fat, uh, body fat, shedding some belly fat, as I talked about uh, last week or in one of my other videos. That's, that's really key. Uh, men, you know, heart attacks, things like that. I don't want to be that guy. I don't want to go through that. Obviously, nobody does, but I want to do something about it. And uh, yeah, that's why I come here and talk about it to you. It helps motivate me. It might help motivate you. And uh, that's that's really it for this week. Uh, if you guys like videos like this, I'd love it if you'd uh, smash that like button. If you want to come back and see more, uh, if you have topics you want to see uh, that you think I might cover, uh, obviously you can always leave notes uh, in the comments on that as well. Uh, but if you like the content uh, that I'm putting out, feel free to subscribe, uh, smash that bell to be notified when I put out a new video. And uh, that's it for this week. Hope you guys are doing well. Hope you're doing what works for you. And uh, we'll talk to you again next week. Bye now.